<clears throat> What's up, guys? Uh, hang on, adjusting things. Okay. <clears throat> What's up, guys? Leopold the Brave, and welcome back to the Universe's episode commentaries. Oh, it feels good to be back, but also stressful. Because you never know how people are going to react to an outcome. We got lots of predictions for Garnet. I mean, DK did win the poll, but lots of people in the comments were like, Garnet, Garnet, because future vision, because, because she's smarter. Like, all things I thankfully um, disproved or debunked in the um, results. Otherwise, people would have been like, you forgot to mention this. Garnet would have won if you mentioned this, but nope. I addressed all the arguments made, which is good. Mainly because I announced the episode way, way before I actually started writing it and working on it and all that stuff. So, I had a lot of time to plan ahead and address certain arguments. So that's good. Um, and next is Megamind versus Gru. So that's going to be interesting. A much smaller matchup compared to this one. This was a pretty big matchup. Considering Steven Universe has been on for a while and Donkey Kong has a lot of games. Um, and a TV show. Uh, but I had already seen most of Steven Universe pretty much. There's only like a few episodes I haven't seen, but I caught up on them for this episode. Um, because I did Jasper versus Jack a while ago, and of course I did Steven versus Dipper when fictional fights are still a thing. So even though I really don't like Steven Universe one bit, I'm still like completely caught up. And I keep watching anyways. It's like, it's like one of those things that's so low quality that it's intriguing and you have to watch it. <laughs> Oof, because Steven Universe is... <clears throat> like, if you look at something like, um, Avatar The Last Airbender, every frame looks like a masterpiece painted by a famous artist. And then you look at Steven Universe, and it's like, what happens if someone accidentally sneezed on that masterpiece at the museum and tried to wipe it off and then ended up smearing the entire thing? <laughs> That's what Steven Universe looks like. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm definitely, I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and say it right now. I'm definitely a bigger fan of Donkey Kong, but I've only touched one Donkey Kong game. The rest of the stuff I get from Donkey Kong is from researching and all that. Um, I think I've only played Donkey Kong Country 64 or Donkey Kong 64. Whichever one it was. I mean, I did play the Super Nintendo one too, but not for very long. I mostly played the 64 version. Um, so I don't know, so I don't know much firsthand about the Donkey Kong stuff. It was mostly all based on research. And it seems people enjoyed the episode a lot. The ratings are good. People are liking it a lot. So I, thankfully, it seems like I did a good job on this episode. Um, next, Megamind for Dis uh, Megamind versus Gru from Despicable Me. Um, that one is going to be fun to do. Um, I just watched Megamind recently and the Despicable Me movies, and I didn't rem I just suddenly remembered after I announced it, I was like, oh yeah, Despicable Me 3 came out. I'm gonna go off to see that in a bit, so I can actually work on the episode, so I will go see that to add to the research of the episode, because I completely forgot there was gonna be a third movie. Because, wow. <laughs> But a fully charged mm. DK punch is strong enough to actually knock So yeah, it was interesting to come back to universes after such a long time. Um, because this job training, which is by the way the worst experience I've had in my entire life, by the way. Um, it's been taking up a lot of time. But I've been able to push out this episode and I think there's only two weeks left of the job training after this. So I can slowly work on Megamind vs. Gru after that and get it out, hopefully soon. Um, but even when I'm free, even when I have more free time, the Universe's episodes are still going to take a while to come out, like in between episodes, because I just want to, I just want to slow down and take my time and get better results to stuff. And also I want to work on other things in between. I don't want my channel to be 100% reliant on Universe's. Um, there's one thing I am disappointed on when it comes to this episode though, is that the views... With people so hyped about Universes coming back, I would have expected it to get a bit more views than it did. But I'm not like, I'm not like upset or anything, I'm just kind of disappointed because I thought it'd be a bit more. I, I don't think it's reached a thousand yet. Usually, usually it reaches a thousand within 24 hours, but it's been almost 48 hours and it still hasn't reached a thousand yet. So I'm kind of a little bit like, aw, man. But maybe once Universes gets back on a nice, regular basis, more people will come back to watch it. And it'll gain a regular audience again, so hopefully you all like it. 
Oh, and something for you guys listening in that aren't on my Discord server. Go join my Discord server because you never know what I'm going to be doing. Sometimes I stream movies and it, and we all just watch and make fun of it together and chat about the movie and it's it's a fun time. But other times I stream Universe's episodes early. Like I showed Donkey Kong vs. Garnet a couple hours on Rabbit before I made it public on YouTube. So, if you're on my Discord server, you'll get a chance to watch Universe's episodes a couple hours early, or maybe even a whole day early. So, be sure to join my Discord, guys. I'll link it in the description. Um, let's see. I actually think that's all I need to talk about. There's not really much to say. Universes is back. You like the episode. The next episode's gonna be hyped. Join my Discord. And that's it. So no need to stretch this out. I hope you enjoyed the return of Universes and the episode commentaries. Join my Discord and see you guys next time.